what is up guys welcome back to a new video here on the channel in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to install scriptic v and scriptic v.net in 2022 so what you're going to want to do is go to the link in my description for scriptic v from devc.com and also scriptic v.net for from github so for scriptic v you just press download and it will download uh but yeah but you want to click this one with this little little cube here and 932 kilobytes for scriptv.net it's going to download like that um, and we're going to open up gta5 here you want to so to find your gta5 main directory or game folder you want to go to if you have it on Epic Games, you go to Epic Games and then GTA 5. If you have it on Steam, you go to Steam Apps, uh, Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, and then it will be there. Um, or you can just right click your GTA 5 if you have a, um, a shortcut on your desktop. If you don't have it on Steam or Epic Games, you can right click. Uh, open file search something like that I think um, but yeah so what you're gonna want to do is you want to right click and you want to hit new and folder and you wanna name it scripts um, lo all lowercase because some mods require it to be lowercase okay so yeah and then you also or then you want to have your um, zip things open so for scriptic v you want to take d input 8.dll and scriptic v.dll and you want to drag and drop them in here i already have them but i'm going to replace them anyways now you can delete the zip but actually for scriptic v you can install a trainer or a menu called native trainer it's not good in my opinion i don't think it's good at all um so I'm going to skip it, but if you guys like it, you can definitely drag and drop it into your directory. You open it by pressing F9, by the way. Um, and then for scriptivv.net, you just drag and drop all of these. I'm not going to drag and drop the INI because I've just set a console key. I'm going to explain that in a second. But just drag and drop all of these things, okay? I'm going to take them, um, accept the INI. Drag and drop them. I'm going to replace them. So for the INI, if you don't want to open the... Oh, I actually have... If you don't want to open the console on F4 um, to type commands and stuff, in my opinion, it's it's kind of annoying, to be honest. Um, then you can just set this to none instead of F4. Then you can delete the zip file, and you have now started out your modding career, I guess we can say. So yeah, you can go to... Uh, the description below and I will link some videos to how to install Menya, which is an amazing probably the best trainer for GTA 5 and also for trainer V or simple native trainer simple trainer it has many names it's also great and also how to install open IV so you can get started with vehicle mods thank you guys for watching I will see you in the next video goodbye